are now watching The Wash daily. Today in news, Massachusetts has significant changes in their cannabis policy, allowing for a caregiver now to have five patients at a time and to have 500 square feet of cannabis space and have an unlimited amount of clones on hand. It's finally some good news for folks in Massachusetts with cannabis. Also, they're allowing cannabis delivery companies to work independently and purchase the cannabis wholesale and deliver them to people's houses. Previously, they were supposed to work with the dispensary, buying cannabis directly from the dispensary, and then adding a surcharge, and then delivering the cannabis. A good move overall, but it's probably not great for the dispensaries who are now at a disadvantage to the delivery companies. Also in news, it looks like Congress is gonna vote on some bills around cannabis. One of them is the Moore Act allows states to determine how they want to roll out their cannabis program, adds a 5% tax to cannabis sales, and tries to make a way for folks who have been disproportionately harmed by the war on drugs to get involved in the cannabis industry. Another piece of legislation that we voted on this year is known as the SAFE Act. The SAFE Act allows banks to work with cannabis companies without becoming involved in legal trouble for working with cannabis companies. Also in news, there's a study showing how cannabis can improve the lives of seniors. There's been a lot of news around older folks who are using cannabis. Studies that support the idea that cannabis is helpful for older folks at end of life care. In terms of pain management, it's widely known that cannabis can eliminate the need for many prescription drugs, if not all of them, and that when people who are using cannabis use cannabis, there isn't any side effects. People use cannabis and their health improves dramatically. Thanks for watching The Wash Daily.